you know. I came down with something called Bell's Palsy. So if you know Bell's Palsy, it was the first time I was hearing it. Bell's Palsy is something that, it comes like a stroke and it sort of affects one side of your face. Are you this guy? What are you? Okay, have you seen the series Shantytown on Netflix? Wait a minute, you've not seen it? Okay, 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 okay. Please, after you watch my video and after you've liked and subscribed to my channel, I am pleading now, go head over to Netflix and watch the series Shantytown. You would love it. It is mind-blowing. Very, very beautiful series. The lead character, Chidi Mokeme, did a brilliant job. He's a 50-year-old man. He's an actor. Mm -hmm. And what else is he? What else is he? He's done good jobs. He has, he, I think he did good at Ultimate Search or he anchored it, one of those ones. But that's not the reason for my video. The reason for my video is because he's had an interview on Channel's television. And he said he had, um, he suffered from Bell's palsy, um, kind of a stroke. But he will explain that. You just hold on. You, I'll, I'll play the interview. Um, he will explain what Bell's palsy is. But take home is, we need to be kind to people. We need to um, show love. Do you get? Because we don't know what people go through on a daily. So I and my husband, we've um, watched the series. We enjoyed it. We, I was, I was amazed at the um, not just the character, but the what's it called now? All the scars on his face, the makeup and whatever. So they had put on like scars that looked real. The tattoos looked real. His eyes were bulging, like bulging out. And I felt like, hmm, they did a really good job. Not knowing that this guy suffered from stroke, partial stroke. Do you get? So let's be kind to one another. Let's, um, um, in as much as it's a movie and everything, um, take home, take home really is be kind, be nice to people because you don't know what people go through. Do you get? And life is unpredictable. Do you get? One day you're healthy, the next minute your body will fail you. It usually does, but we hope that it won't. We pray for good health for everyone. But yeah, please watch my video till the end and head over to Netflix and watch the series Shantytown. And I'll catch you guys in my next video. Bye. My new project, you know. So, um, yeah, I've been off the scene for a while, you know. I was actually off the scene for a while. Uh, after we did the promotional tour for 76, you know, and uh, we went to the Toronto International Film Festival. Uh, I'll say something, you know, that I haven't actually said anywhere else because uh, after that, we were preparing to go on the trip to. UK for the British International Film Festival, you know. I came down with something called Bell's Palsy. So if you know Bell's Palsy, it was the first time I was hearing it. Bell's Palsy is something that, it comes like a stroke and it sort of affects one side of your face and sort of gives you a droop, you know. And this uh, was something that the doctor said was incurable. They had no cure because they didn't know what causes it, so they didn't know how to treat it. You know, so for an actor, if you come down with something that affects your face, you know, you can imagine what I must have been going through at the time. I thought it was something I could move around with. And I tried to come for the Lagos premiere of 76 at the time, but the attention was sort of focused on the face rather than the premiere and the things that were happening at the time. So I knew that, no, it wasn't something that I could work with. So I said, okay, wow. I'll take off time. Yeah, I'll take time off, you know, to try and go sort out that problem that needed my face to be in top top shape, you know. So in the meantime, I just focus on doing my other business. And one of the other businesses that I do is um, uh, seasonal lightings and decor, you know. So I do Christmas lightings, commercial quantity Christmas lightings. We work for state governments, you know, around the country, yeah. lighting up the states for seasonal purposes. Yeah. So that didn't really need my face to be showing. So I just focus my attention on that while I was trying to get myself back. So it took a while, you know, to get that back.